Hi, I'm Greg Haynes, and I live in Rowlett, Texas. That's just outside of Dallas, a suburb, probably about 20 minutes out. And uh, I have a little cooler ice business with five machines, and I've named it JBS Ice, J being Joey, and B being Benjamin, and S being Savannah, that's my three kids. And ultimately, one of the reasons we got into this business was so we could pass it on and have some something that generates income for them. So, we have JBS Ice. By trade, I'm a photographer. I have a little school picture business where I take pictures of private schools and daycares. And I started that business about 30 years ago. Of course, I was a lot younger then and agile and picking up kids all day long was not a big deal. But once you hit 50, you know, you start thinking, is there a better way to make some money that doesn't involve, you know, picking kids up all day long? So, I began looking for another uh, income source. Uh, but about 10 years ago, I was called into ministry. I'm an associate pastor and children's pastor at my church. And uh, my wife and I launched a, a 501c3 called Carry the Light Ministries. And uh, what we do specifically is build orphanages. Uh, our vision is to build 10 orphanages by the year 2020. Thus, we call it our 2020 vision. So, got a lot of responsibility there. and. Man, I was just looking for a way that I could uh, schedule my time to be able to travel internationally but also have an income stream while I'm away. And so I began researching, but I don't like employees, and so I was looking for some way that I could earn money um, when I was sleeping, earn money when I was on vacation, or uh, when I was at the lake here. Next thing I know, my nephew calls me and said, man, I, I saw a, one of those cooler ice machines on a trailer in somebody's front yard with a for sale sign on it. And so within two or three hours, I met that person and we talked about it and, and I found my first uh, cooler ice 810, I think they call it, machine and purchased it and put new graphics on it, put new ice talk on it, made it just state of the art and uh, put it in the field, learn the process of the permitting with the city and preparing the site to receive it with electrical and plumbing and, and all that. And uh, got our first machine in the field. And man, we were so excited about it. So we bought our first machine in October of 2014 and bought our second machine, another 810. Uh, on December 31st, I was real adamant about closing on that date because I needed a tax write-off for that year. Uh, so we had a couple of 810s going on. And then we, we rocked on, we really went through our first summer uh, season of the ice business, enjoyed it, uh, made some money. And uh, so then uh, I found uh, a couple of 2500s and they wound up being by far my biggest producers. Um, they were in a different city though. And so because of that and because of the travel back and forth, I kind of fell in love with the city here in Granbury and uh, the lake here and so I wound up purchasing a little lake house here so now I've got two homes thanks to Cooler Ice because I'd have never done that otherwise. I tell you if if it wasn't for the Ice Talk portal uh, there's no way that I'd be in this business. Uh, as I mentioned earlier I wear a lot of hats uh, my time is is very limited. Uh, I get up in the morning and by seven o'clock here in the summer, you know, we've, we've made over $100 in, in ice sales. By my second cup of coffee, I'm usually over $200. Uh, I go and I actually visit every one of my machines during my first couple of co cups of coffee because I have video cameras on, on all the machines. I've mounted cameras inside the ice makers. I've mounted cameras on the key parts to, to monitor the reverse osmosis pressure system, to monitor the funnel where the ice falls out on the big 2500 machines to make sure there's no stoppages there. Uh, I've just done a lot of uh, upgrades, personal uh, upgrades of my own ideas to try and save my time so that I can run this business. So we've got four machines in the field. Recently I ran across uh, another machine and I purchased it, another 810, and uh, I was able to refurbish it, put the graphics and, and the ice talk in it, and I mounted it just probably five minutes from our lake house here back in at the end of uh, April, and uh, it's picking up nicely already. I was real careful to try and get it in just before the heavy season so it could have some visibility. And uh, so we're operating five machines right now. Man, I'll tell you, one of the most important aspects of Cooler Rice, and, and, and one of the things that really drew me to this brand was the machines are just beautiful. I mean, 
they market themselves. The, the graphics that are on them are first class. They're visible from a long distance. And you don't even have to be able to read the name Cooler Ice. You recognize this is an ice machine. The blue awnings that are on them, they're pretty. They, uh, they draw your eyes to it. Uh, some of the things that I like to do in addition to just the fact that it's a pretty machine is, is I'll put a, a feather flag. Of course it says ice and water and it's flapping in the wind and it's a pretty sign too. My favorite thing about Cooler Ice, I can figure out almost any problem on the machine. But when I can't figure it out, I know that I can call Cooler Ice from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. I'm not sure which time zone that is. but you know, many times I know that whatever time zone they're in is far beyond 7 p.m. and they're still answering the phone. Tommy, oh my gosh, he is amazing. He will walk you through everything that you need to know if you've got to fix a machine and he cares. He wants you to get it fixed. Mike is another guy. They're amazing people in the support staff. I don't know all of their names, but those guys are there and they're ready to help you and they want you to be successful in this business. If you want to get into the ice business, first of all, go and visit ice machines. Do your research. Make sure that you're going with a company that cares about your success. Uh, make sure that you're going with a company that has all of the support. And make sure you go with a company that answers the phone. Cooler Ice does that.